What is going on everyone and welcome to Zucosis. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Zucosis is very popular right now. So let's jump right into it. Without further ado, let's play. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Okay. Definition of confidential information. Any information obtained by the night zookeeper during his employment is considered confidential. Click here to sign. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Paul Colony. That's Excellent. my signature. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. Good. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Ever thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo? <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, Aww. you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? What? What? You'll find out later. Hey! I didn't give you permission to do that. That wasn't in the contract. He's dragging me away now? What the hell are you doing, man? Hey! Okay. I'm waking up here. What oh, happened? Are you finally awake? Good. Get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. You vaccinate me? So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Did you guys see the subtitles error there? So I got the job? Oh, whoa. Whoa. This view is crazy. That'll get you motion sick for sure. It's quite spacious here. What do you want me yep. to do here? This is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Load two herbal and one vegetable bricks into the brick trolley. Okay. Let's see. Two herb. Oh, that's a big guy. Oh, that's a big one right there. Oh man, is this how processing plants actually work? Limits to my patience. What do you mean? I'm going. I'm doing this fast. Come on. Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. Okay. Oh. What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. Sure. So let's move Here's this, Charlie. K A T I E. Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. Oh, cool. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Sure. Sure, why not? I could do that. Wait. Wait. There it is. <laughs> I couldn't find the control panel. Giraffe. Fasten your seat belts and sit up straight. Let's go. Okay. That is one creepy grinning out there. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Okay, so we're at the giraffes, I'm assuming. So we're at the giraffe station. Now listen carefully, I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for our animals. Are they sick? Well, they can be. 
We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously, and we should all be safe for another day. Follow me. This is okay. our kitchen factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Excellent. <laughs> Sue needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. All right, enough chit-chat. Go to the cutting table. Okay, sure. Kitchen factory! You need to select the giraffe from the list. Okay, giraffe. Press on the cook button to go to the slicing screen. Click on the cut button to slice herbs. Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure carefully. Excellent, Paul. Cut. Now do the same with the herbal brick from the recipe. Go ahead. 1.5, so it's about half. Cut it about here. 1.5, okay. Did I mess up the first one? I think I messed up the first one. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Figuring this out. Slowly but surely. Oh, I'd love to. Let's push this trolley. Oh, I have to pull it? Okay, I'm pulling. I can't look backwards. Oh, a little lizard! Cool. I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train? Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You won't see anything like it in others. Pride? But then why has the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. I'm this moving is the it. entrance to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. Okay. Did I just collect those posters or something? I think I just got a collector's item or something. Giraffe enclosure. Before leaving, make sure that all of the symptoms are detected. So let's open it up. Take the bucket and dump the food in the feeding area. Oh, oh, hi! Look at the giraffe! It's so beautiful. Look! Look at Wait, where are you going? Do you want something? Are you hungry? What can I do for you? Oh, look at these giraffes! Oh, I'll pet you. Hi! Pet an animal for the first time. Achievement. I'll take that. Oh! It's so cute! How about you, Cleo? Cleo, can I give you a pet? Do you even notice me here? Oh my god, that was weird. I don't know what just happened there, but... Alright. A little bit of a glitch there. <laughs> okay. Got some loving from the giraffes. Now, what must I do? What's that noise? Is that water? Oh, speakers? Assuming it's just speakers. Where's the rest of the dress? Oh, feeding area. Do I have anything on me? I don't have anything on me. Oh, yeah, so I forgot the bucket. Oh! Hey, hey! Are you hungry? You guys hungry? I probably have to put it in your feeding dish over here. Here, come with me, guys. Oh my god, that scared me. These guys were chasing me down. Woo! Okay. We're safe. Let's feed them. Oh, yeah, that looks delicious. Oh, yummy. You guys enjoy that. Okay. Return the bucket to the gadget trolley. Sure. 
Let's do that. Graphics in this game are absolutely amazing. Great. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile Fecal Extractor. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. I what? No. Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, okay. Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. Okay. Come on, Paul. Don't uh, chicken out. Uh, I'm not comfortable with this. I have to extract fecal matter from what? Their butts? You've got to be kidding me. Cleo, how you doing? How you doing? You wanna lift that tail of yours? Maybe it's, maybe I just pet you. I'm just gonna pet you for now. Hi. Yeah, you're not really gonna enjoy what I'm gonna do to you. What do I do? How do I... How do I swap? How do I insert? I will figure this out in just a moment. Guys, I'm an idiot. I'm a freaking idiot. I just have to suck up the poop from here. I don't have to put this in their butts. What? I don't want to do that. Hey, Poe, I haven't pet you yet, but I don't think you need a pet. Okay. That's two poops. Here's a third poop. So they've all eaten. I got all their poop. Yummy. Give me that. Okay. Let's go back to our dear friend and figure out what we have to do next. We will return this to the trolley. Now take the TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Sure. Okay, where's the TIS? Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Install it, huh? Measure the temperature of all giraffes. So what, do I just go really close by? View, how are you doing? 39.6, I think that's okay. Uh-oh. Hey. I'm gonna have to move it. Cleo, how are you doing? How is your temperature? 38.7? Okay, that's pretty good. And where's our last friend? Somewhere over here. Hiding somewhere. Where are you? Oh. Oh, look at the poor giraffe. Oh, are you sleeping? Why do you seem really hot? 43.0? Uh-oh, you got a cold. You got a fever. What can I do? Are you oh, you're sleeping for 30 seconds. Okay, I see. Alright. Let's go back. That's As you how we return One of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with Temperalax. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact of with course. the terminal and press the exit and closure button. Sure, I could do that. Let's close it up. Our job in the here terminal, is. You can check all the analyses you've collected done. in this enclosure. Right. Okay. I guess I don't do anything about the sick. Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn. How do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got kicked out in the first year. No worries. That should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What are we doing next? Are you following me? Do I just go? See you later? Goodbye! See ya, Doc! Where must we, we go now? Can we go back in? I have to take the trolley, what am I thinking? Honestly, this game is pretty cool. I'm really enjoying it. The graphics are amazing. 
The playstyle is awesome. The mechanics are pretty cool. This is a pretty awesome game, if you ask me. Congratulations, Paul. You've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place. <laughs> sure, why not? Um, MFE. Where does it go? In here. I see. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Okay, I'll put this back. Okay. Door's open. We're golden. Whoa! Why are you so jumpy? Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. Um, for the record, you actually did not scare me, okay? Nice try. Okay, we gotta get the trolley back in with this. This is our mobile vet station. To make temporal acts, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Oh. Okay, good to know, good to know. Alright, let's find this. Temper lax. Oh, it's right there. I gotta create some of that. Some tranquilizers. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Cool, you've got temper lax. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. In the troll? Over here? Oh, dart gun. Oh my god, that is crazy. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, yeah, no, that's gotta be adjusted. That is so quick! How do I load it? Good. R, obviously. Is to dart the sick giraffe. Okay. Poor giraffe. Okay, let's go back then. The sick giraffe, Paul. Be careful, don't confuse Bo with Po. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll try not to. I will figure this out on my own. I got this. I am not worried at all. Let's open it up. Alright. Poe. Where are you, Poe? Actually, I'm gonna adjust my sensitivity really quick. Guys, I'm sorry. I know. I'm not gonna shoot you guys. I'm not gonna shoot you guys. I know. I'm sorry. Oh. Poe. Oh. Oh my god, this aim is so horrible. Okay, so guys, I couldn't change the sensitivity for some reason. Oh, MG, this is nuts. Boom! Gotcha! Look at that! Shot him right in the chest. Alright, sweet. Okay, you guys are more chill now. I just vaccinated that giraffe. And it should be good now. So I think I could close the enclosure and move on. Look at that. I've cured all the animals. Beautiful! Alright, giraffes are done. Let's run back. Doc, where are you? Are you over here? Yeah, hey, you're still here. You're still hanging out. Hey, I did so it. So everything went smoothly? Seems like it. Did. I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Sure, let's go back to the hub. So we'll just go into the control panel and go back to base. This is actually so cool, guys. Like, check this out. Oh, never mind. You can't check it out. Look at that. We're traveling in a train. And now we're inside a facility. The hub. Let's go, Paul. Escort me to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. Sure. Okay. I'll lead you out to the exit, which is right here. I knew that. <laughs> Vile box. Can I take these vials? I 
can. Okay, so I got a whole bunch of items there. Well, that's nice. Every zookeeper is entitled to a right. service car. This one's mine. If you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Oh! Is that your wife? Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. No problem. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Say something luck, to her. Paul. Don't mess up. You're gonna let her just sit out in the rain? What? I can't believe I'm doing that. You're such an asshole. Oh, okay, she's gone. Never mind. Maybe you said something. <laughs> okay, guys, looks like we're on our own now. I should have watched her drive away. That is so cool. Entered here. Who knows how long ago? You're not answering calls. I'm worried. Hey, Lily, sweetheart. Sorry, didn't hear you right away. Everything's okay. They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. You should just go home. I'll be back in the morning and tell you everything. Paul, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah, it's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Okay. Put a meat brick in there. And a little parcel thing. Okay. I'm just gonna give her a block of meat? How would I do that though? What is she gonna do with it? Alright, so we need a brick of meat. Which is very odd. That does not look appetizing at all. It's just plastic covered meat. But that's fine. Alright, babe. Here you go. This is for you. Lily, are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from Daddy. It's time for me to work. Do it. Babe, take it. Babe, where are you? I don't see you. I don't think she took the meat. I didn't even see her. She's gone. Where'd you go? Alright, well, have a good night. Bye, babe. I gotta get to work. Okay, so what I think I want to do is I actually want to add a couple more herbs and a couple more vegetables to this trolley and then go to the... The Katie? Is that what it was called? I think it was called the Katie. Oh, look at that. Where's the switch for the meat, though? How do we get more meat? I don't know if we can get more meat. Hey, look, I got some fish. So you know what? I'll add some fish to here. Why not, right? Might as well. Maybe I'll grab a couple more vegetables. I'll grab one more, just in case. Alrighty, let's take this to Katie. And we'll load her up. Sweet. Control panel. Wallaby. Alright, let's do the wallabies next. That sounds like a lot of fun. We Here we go. Donate blood. Cool. Maybe one day. Look at that, we're at the wallaby station. So let's uh get the trolley out. And we'll push this to the next spot. Heck yes. I guess we're gonna pull it instead. Oh, no. That goes back there. And now let's pull this. Is there gonna be something scary crawling on the walls? I think it's a little... Oh, I can sprint! Hey. Hello, ring ring! Hello! Who's that? Who's here? Oh, look. Free stuff. I like free stuff. Alright. Who's on the phone? Night Zookeeper. Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God. Finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist. Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, babe. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Then, one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. 
Ma'am, this doesn't feel right. One seven six eight. Paul, I'm begging you. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. Okay, fine. But I'll do that later. I got some work to do. I gotta do my job. There's a reason why I am working right now. Oh, what's this? Data. Anthony Hopwood. I just saw something horrible. I shot lethal dart, but one wasn't enough. It took around 300 milliliters, but it worked. Fuck, it worked. I'm alive. Interesting. Um, is there any more? Cars are these new? No, I know how to do all that. Oh, but I can't go to a second. Oh, can I? I can't go to the second page. It doesn't let me move my mouse down there. All right. Uh, tasks. Access. Oh, there's my inventory. Cool, cool. Okay, check the wallaby enclosure. Check the enclosure. Feed the animals. Collect analysis. Measure the temperature. Measure the sound. Submit blood for analysis. Submit feces for analysis. All right, easy enough. We can totally do that. Nice and quick here. After we loot up. There's a bunch of goodies over here. Look at all these. Oh, I got a tranquilizer. That's nice. It's always good to have one of those when you have crazy animals. Take note. Oh, I'm taking notes. Oh! NASA. Animal Sound Spectrum Analyzer. Oh, okay. It's just extra information, I guess. There's something there, too. And here as well. Gotta collect everything, right? Oh, items. Wow, you could easily miss a whole bunch of items, guys. You gotta be very careful here. Okay, all right, before leaving, make sure that all the symptoms are detected. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Let's open it up. Oh, look at the wallaby, oh! Hello, Penny and Sally, how are you doing? How are you guys doing? Okay, first off, I need the TIS because I want to check you guys' temperature, make sure you guys are okay. One of you looks sick already. Okay, Sally, you look fine. 38.6. Amy, oh, Amy's running away. Okay, Wally is sick. Or has a cold, I guess. I gotta check the other ones really quickly. Okay, can you stay right here for me? Amy? Don't make this hard. Okay, thank you. 41.0, that's not good. What is that? Okay. Penny. Penny, stay here. You're good. Good to know. How many are there of you guys, huh? I checked you guys' temperatures. I think it's just the three of you. Blood syringe. I need... Blood analysis from them, right? Hey Sally, come here. Okay, what are you doing? I'm just gonna take a little bit of blood. Came and see what I'm doing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is gonna hurt. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, I feel so bad. Okay, that's one. Wally, you're next, please. Thank you. Oh, they're so nice. They just lay down for you. Oh, but they whimper when you stab them with the syringe. Oh, you poor guys. I'm sorry. Okay. Where's our last wallaby? Penny, hi. Hi, how are you? Just gonna take a little bit of blood. I'm sorry. Oh, it's so terrible. I feel so bad. Okay. Got your blood. And then next. Wait, I need yours too. Is there four of you guys? Okay, look at that. Okay, I gotta listen to you guys really quick. Thirty-nine. Sure. Okay. Okay. Wally, your last. 
stay here, please. Where are you going? Thank you, thank you. That's all I had to do. Okay, so I've checked all their temperatures. I've checked the sound readings on them. I've got a sample of all their blood. And now I just need to get their food to get a sample of their poop. And then I think we're good to go. We'll push this trolley all the way back. Awesome, awesome. Put the trolley back in here and we're gonna have to cut some food. Okay, so for the wallabies, I have 4.0, I need 2.0, and vegetables 7.4, I only need one. Okay, easy. So, we're gonna cook. Um, animals can vomit if you deviate from the recipe, 50%. Okay, alright, so we're gonna cut herbal. I need 2 grams, so that's literally dead center. 2.1? Oh, it's off! Damn, I suck. Okay, and now I need one kilogram of this. Oh, that's a lot of weight. How much is this? Uh, so I'm kind of going to try and divide it by eights. So about here, maybe. Is that enough? 1.3 deviation, 0 0.1 deviation, 0 0.3. Okay, I think that's good. 11% of 50%. Oh, I did a good job. That was pretty close if you ask me. Oops. That's how we get out of here. All right, the food is prepped. Oh, and I gotta put all the blood in here. Can't forget to donate it all. All right, and that's the fourth one. Nice and easy. Okay, blood is ready for analysis. Um, okay, let's see here. All right, I need okay diagnosis. Okay, Amy and Wally. It's just a temperature thing. So it's just temperature. It's RTIs, and they both are just dealing with temperature issues on the poo first. So I gotta feed them to make sure that their poop is fine first. Okay, I should have got the food first, so I'm going to bring the food back because I just made it. I'm gonna feed them, get their poop, and then go back. Hey you guys, you guys hungry? Come on guys, I got some food for you. I got some food. Here you guys go. Oh, lovely slop. Oh, that looks so good. You guys enjoy. Haha, oh, that's so cute. That is so awesome. Now I just need them to poop. I'll put that back. Thank you. All right, we'll take the MFE. Get some poop. Poop, poop, poop. Is there some here? Oh, lovely. Thanks. Nice and fresh. I love it. Thank you. There's the third one, and I see the fourth one right over there. Okay, guys, we got all their poop. Let's go back and analyze it. Put the poop in here. So we can't have any bacteria spreading. Lovely, lovely. All right. Okay, so poop seems fine. So I just need two RTIs. Okay, so what am I gonna need in here? Does it tell me what I need? RTIs? Can I just make RTIs in here? No, I guess not. So let's go through these and figure it out. Okay guys, so it says here in the description that respiratory tract infections are viral or bacterial. So when I go over to the crafting section, I notice that Bactigard is a substance based on the synthetic antibacterial component for the treatment of bacterial infections. So there's this option, and also I think it was Temperlax? Yeah, Temperlax is an anti-inflammatory substance with the expectorants for the treatment of acute respiratory viral infections. So is it this one or is it the other one? I'm not sure, but I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make two of these and two Bactigards maybe. So I'm gonna make two of each and just go with that and I guess we'll figure it out. I'll take my shots and hopefully uh, we'll see what happens. Oh, look at that. Thank you, thank you, and thank you. Let's 
kind of cool. All right, let's go back. We're gonna try these little vaccinations and hopefully they work. Let's open her up. Nice, lovely. All right, dart gun. Let's do it. Sally, Penny, you guys are fine. It's Amy. So I don't want to put the tranquilizer in there. So we'll swap M3 to change. Okay, so we're gonna start with Temperlax. Not Penny, not Penny, not Penny, not Penny. Amy, Amy, Amy. Sit still, please. No, no, no. I'm not doing anything. Nothing. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Whoa, whoa. Where are you going? Where are you going? Whoa, 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 whoa. Amy, where are you going? Wally, Wally, hey, 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 hey. Okay. Wally. Got him right in the butt. And Wally's good. Look at that. Wally's been cured of his sickness. And now Amy. Got you, yes! We did it! Yeah, that's all it took. It was the temporal axe. We didn't have to worry about the back to guard. But I made two of them anyways, so I don't know, it is what it is. Hopefully we'll use them later. Congratulations, you have cured all the animals. Damn right I did. Wallabies, you are good to go. And I am also good to go. So let's take the trolley back to the hub. And, oh. Hello? Wait, wait, wait. Collectible. Ooh, nice. Uh, hello? Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, man. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What's with the ma'am? Oh, nothing. A woman called. Looking for someone named CJ. Searching for her husband. That bitch again. Although CJ's no saint either. Always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab. And we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. Sure. Excellent. I'll call you later. Oh man, I have to receive stuff too. Whoa! Whoa! Why am I throwing up? What happened? What's going on? Am I okay? Uh, whoa! That's not a good sign. I might need to have my temperature checked. Now, why would I be throwing up though? It's kind of weird. Must be infected with something. Alright, back to the hub. And we are back. I've been doing some looking around. This is supply, and there's a number one here, so I'm assuming this is what we have to do here. Let's receive our new stuff. Um. Okay. Alright, that's not good. <laughs> That is definitely not good. Uh, I'm gonna have to cut Hello? that out. I, I mean, oh jeez, oh jeez, nudity. Don't There's worry, nudity. Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Oh, I definitely do. I thought you had beef or uh, I don't know lamb in the fridge, and there. And there's a long neck pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals, and they turn into. How shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. What the... What the hell is the mother? <laughs> Relax. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Fuck! I gave a piece of meat to my wife. You did what? <laughs> Sorry, Paul, but it's really ridiculous. Life gives you a chance to become a worthy, well-off person, and you take the easy way. Descending to simple theft. There won't be any more indulgence. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. They'll say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. Just tell me where my phone is. I'll call Lily. Maybe she and Gina haven't eaten yet. I won't allow it, chum. If you call your wife, it'll be a direct violation of the NDA. No, Paul, you won't drag me into this. You'll have to fully feel the consequences of your misdeed. And now stop whining and go to work. 
Oh my. This is messed up. So feed infected animals. Okay, I got a whole bunch of new tasks to do. Um, alright. Well, guys, that's all the time I have for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, uh, stay tuned for the next episode because this is really fun and really exciting. And I can't wait to play again. So, yeah, with that being said, see you in the next one, guys. Alright, take care. Bye.